Hello there, this is Ben Fournier, or Benevolent Side of Core. I'm going to continue the Easy Act gameplay, and yes, I know easy is lame. However, yeah, blah blah blah. However, I like not taking 10 trillion years for every battle. Okay. Ooh, they've combined their stuff or something, whatever. Okay, now, that didn't take 10 trillion years, that's nice. Okay. Sometimes it seems like it does. Oh wait, we're going after Volantis. Wow, you gotta be aware of those, um, necromorphs, they. Eh? Completed ion energy level 6. Completed nano electronics level 2. Completed quantum cognition level 2. Everything's number two, eh? That makes sense in this world. Max that. Okay. Yeah, it didn't really work as well as I thought it would to make that anything particularly, you know, a fast destroyer. So let's just... Oh, we can't add another battleship, so, alright. Just upgrade everything as much as we can. Like all these are eights. Eight. Eight. And that's the max is eight. Okay. If we really want to hear a sonar ding that lasts for the next ten trillion years, this is the way to go it. But the more stuff upgraded, the better. Even if it's like a pain to get it done. Upgrades are how you win. Because let's say you have a max out fleet and it's all garbage. <laughs> That's not going to be useful. Well, I mean, like, max out in terms of numbers. Max out here is what's the good thing there. But alrighty, uh, anything we can do, let's build up this stuff. Uh, upgraded, 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 whatever. There's all that done. Oh, can we build cities here? Let's increase the population of Insanity. There, and another one. Can we spend a little on that? There we go. So that's more taxation income or something, right? So, well, not that it's going to benefit the fleet, but all right, time to fight the uh, the necromorphs over here in Volantis. Hopefully, not virtually. That would not go well. Seventy five. Uh, and you have any enemy that can just wallow your entire yes, commander. Uh, garrisons or whatever, you know, your ship crews turn them into enemy troops. Basically, that's not a good thing. Fortunately, that's not something that we have to deal with so far as I know. It would be an interesting component to the game, that's for sure. Uh, I wish I could play Stellaris. I don't think it would run on this computer, though, but someday, eventually, it would be nice. Ah, the joy. Oh, look, we can go over here and... Let's see. Yeah, that's enough. We can take that out. Not even have to waste the torpedo heading toward them. Okay, and these guys, where can they go? Awesome. This will do well. Hey, would you like some extra crispifying photons of doom? There's some. See if we can get them all on the first turn just by lasers and plasma. Oh, it would be nice if they had an animation that only lasts like one second rather than 20. But, unfortunately that's not how this goes. So, next. Okay, you. Mr. Dude. Another animation that lasts way too long. I wish I knew how to modify things. Like, when I was a kid, I had once changed, like, what the audio uh, thing reference to was in uh, Command and Conquer Red Alert. Like, I don't remember exactly how I did it, but it was basically like I swapped which uh, sound file was named something or whatever. So it would be like 
Yeah, the doctor, the medics, which say the uh, mechanics phrase of I'll get my wrench. So uh, it's like, what kind of doctor Atlantis is this? 75 has joined our federation. Yay, the necromorphs weren't so annoying this time. Woo. Alrighty. And it's all the bad guys are up here. Alrighty. So, move the fleet there. And onward to this one. Dun da da da. Wah wah wah. Say, would you like to be extra with Approaching me? Approaching Leonis 28. Yeah, yeah. Yes, Commander. Come on. Come on, come on. Ah, uh, fewer asteroid fields. Well, they do look like they have plenty of ships, that's for sure. I don't know if I could get them all this turn by lasers. I don't think so. I think I will have to torpedo them. Oh, weird. That is a ton. But this is what torpedoes are for. Let's see. Alrighty. Well, let's get everyone behind cover as much as possible, anyway. Yeah, not everyone can be. And of course they'll go after anyone who's not. to that one. Yeah, they might aggro to both of them since they have them pointed like that. These might be the only time that they exist in this game. So let's just do that. Send, I think they can both send a couple apiece, right? Good. Let's do that. Sorry, this is going to take forever, but I'd rather make sure I get as much fire on the field as possible since it is a large fleet. Oh, did I get all the torpedoes? Yep, okay, that one, that one, now this. coverage on that, even though there's not as many ships there at the moment. They might have a chance to put a few torpedoes toward me as well, but I'm thinking it's not going to do as much. I mean, it would stink if I let them get to me, but I'm thinking they won't have much time. Unless they all just flee in panic. Which is a funny quote from, uh... Oh, short circuit. You know, it's like, uh... The guard notices that, uh, Johnny Five's woken up and he's like, I suggest we flee in panic. Something like that in it. That was a pretty funny movie. One character had my name. What do you do though, my first name anyway. That anyway. Onward to tossing more stuff at this stuff. Such eloquence. Much humor. Woo. I know, I must be so interesting. And yet, I don't know. I'm here to play games and extra crispify enemies, so 
I hope everyone likes my content eventually, or at least more than don't, but it is rather depressing when it's just like, you know, some can get away with doing next to nothing, but, you know, they look nicer or whatever, so they get more attention. Versus, of course, I'm ugly and I don't show my face, so I only have the content I make and not just attention otherwise. whoop de doo Yay, you're launching stuff at me rather than firing lasers. That's good. And we've Maximum been starship capacity reached. thousand years. Come on. Extra crispy. Nice shot. 1699. Well, that would have been in a, during the age of sail. Come on. <sighs> yeah. Detonate. Doom, do doom, doom. Do do do. Do 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 do. Doom, do do do. do, 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 do. They're hiding behind the planet. Most of them. Mostly. Oh well. Maybe next turn. Uh, this one could get some. Uh, let's get these back here first. Nice shot. Two down at least. Come on. Why must it do that? The joy. Nope. Alrighty, next. Yeah, this one can do that. Goodbye, fighters. Alrighty. Come on, come on. Nuke it from a little bit, yeah. Oh, just a little bit further. Come on. Let's get going. Yeah, yeah. Uh, almost. And there's a whole bunch of nothing for now. Come on, come on. Let's go. Okay. Nice shot. That worked for one of them. <sighs> the game just drags on when it does that. Yes, that's pretty much explosion. Or something much booming. Oh no, torpedoes are boomers. Ooh, just joking. You know, the thing about the whole boomer mindset is not every boomer has it. I used to live in a campground and most of my neighbors were of the actual boomer generation, but they didn't have that mindset. You know, living in poverty, like the Thessalonians, gives you a different outlook on life than having grown up in more favorable circumstances like the Laodiceans. So it's really more like a Laodicean mindset compared to a Thessalonican mindset, for the Bible anyway. Where it's just within recent generations, the one that has more general prosperity due to better times was one that is more like the Laodiceans than, but only in general. Yeah, that is the thing though. You have generalities and you have exceptions to everything. It is fun to the generalization that no generalization is uh, completely true is usually used to negate the uh, concept of generalization even though it's like they're still generally true. They may not be true fully but they're still a good rule of thumbs. For some things anyway. Of course you can have generalities that are based on irrelevant criteria in which case they have no merit. Like things that are superficial or worthless pretty much. But, uh, yeah. unless it's like, you know, noticing some things reflect light better. Yeah. 
but either way, like mylar, or that thing's the color blue. Do there. Come on, come on. Come on, word. Come on, move it, move it. Move it, move it. Yeah, move it, move it. Uh, come on, why must it take forever? I'm sure everyone says the same thing about me, though. Like, why aren't you rich already? You should have been an accountant. It's like, yeah, I maximized my earning potential before leaving me, right? Oh well. I mean, Jackie, if I, I had, if I didn't have a feeling, I would have been the route that you want me to more. But it's like Rasmussen was a scam, as far as I could tell. It cert certainly felt like a scam. Overpriced nonsense. Middle school grade. If even that, somewhere like... What is it? Uh, call it coffee table books for like their astronomy one. That was a joke. 2,000 bucks for a class which didn't even have any math, not even basic orbital mechanics, and it's going to cost 2,000 bucks to write essays on what hypothetical aliens might look like on different gravity worlds. I mean, seriously? What? Oh well. Like, is this supposed to be science or just science fiction? was a whole bunch of wasted time and yet it's like trying to make me into something useful to farm the wallet of. Yay. Yeah, whatever. So much fun. Onward to moving all the torpedoes. I'm doing oh, you're running eh? I don't see why. Why would you run? Or why wouldn't everyone else? Nice shot. Maybe they had the right idea. Of course, once I go through the wormhole and say hello, it's not going to matter much either. I probably could do that now. Just well, I mean, there's all these torpedoes I fired that have to go first, but yeah. Oh well. Onward to the crispy bad guys. Oh, anyone see the uh, fire hydrant turret thing? Or not the fire hydrant turret, but like a water turret to put out uh, fires that has like a, a smart camera heat sensor thing or whatever on it. And uh, it, it looks very cool, although it looks like they could turn it into a flamethrower easily too. Oh, I missed that. Oh well. I was paying attention to what I was saying more than the game. Enemy lasers disabled. Awesome. Ah, these. Let's just detonate them all. We can win just by running up the target. Oh, come on. We'll get from more of it, yeah. What would these have to be to have that much effect? They'd have to pretty much be, you know, one of those types of things. Or like a whole bunch of shrapnel, anyway. Alrighty, you. Let's see you go there and what happens. Enter the jump gate. That was useless. Okay, you go there. Let's see how that works. Enter the jump gate. Okay, that didn't go well either. Is that a single link one? Enter the jump gate. Ah, my word. Alright, one more to go. Come on. Oh, good grief. Someone was like, I put a ton of work on this animation, you're gonna watch it. Yay. Okay, let's see how this goes. Are we gonna go somewhere? Enjoy the game. Good, there we go. Next time, I hope. 
Are we done? I guess we'll find out whenever this gets done. Yay, we're done. Are we done? Can this be done? Is there someone else? Good somewhere? work. Anywhere? Here we go. Leonis 28 Yay. has joined our federation. Excellent choice. Okay. So, time for more bad guys as soon as it lets me move. Oh, good grief. Approaching Kankri 63. Yep. Okay. Yes, Let's Commander. Go. Uh, it is slowing down. I have my air conditioner right by my computer to keep it cool, but this is rather slow. Alrighty, we have very few enemies. Good. Entering Jackie. Okay, zero, zero. Wow, these asteroids dissipating, it says, but for right now it's kind of useless. Well, at least we should be shielded. Let's see if other wormhole actions will be useful though. Oh, I should have fired another torpedo maybe, but uh Entering jump gate. Let's see though. Enemy, yeah, not the most useful. No, come on. Let's get going. Yeah, yeah. Surprise. The surprise is they should look out their window. Entering jump gate. Entering narrow passage. Oh, one less. So now after this is finally done, we can keep moving. Uh, can we use a torpedo right there right now? That could be cool. Disabled. Something's disabled. Cool. Well, that was a blast. Let's see if we can do a second round if they need it. One might need it. It's not having that animation like that one anyway. Uh, two of them still need it. Okay, well, I can't move that one. Ah, uh, let's leave it there. Cool, this one can move over here. 38, 0, okay. And not the most useful. Uh, if they don't move. No, they might not be able to. Or they'll have to repair if they can. Uh, zero, zero, whoa. Anything there? If we move here, will it be anything? Anything? Nope. Oh, fine. Let's keep going, I guess. Let's see which way they go, if they go anywhere. And drive the gate. Put one over here just in case they got it. Alrighty, and you, Mr. Dude, where will you Enter go? Okay. Another useless location. Yay. Ah, the joy. The joy. Alright, let's see how this goes. Somewhere. Oh, still have another one. Fine. There. Alrighty. Now well, let's see how we can do this. We're moving. I think not enough. Run, run. Yeah, 
do, do. Come on. Oh, come on, just move. Why must it be this way? This is seriously going to make me try to figure out how to mod this. Feel like cut down the timer from 10,000 years apiece to like a second. Maybe half a second. Come on. Okay. Nice shot. Are we done? Please, let's be done. We have one more thing to go after. Good work. Yay. Pancre 63 has joined our federation. Excellent choice. Alrighty. Ah, come on, come on. Let's get going. One more. And then I'll call this done. Well, I mean, the turn on the end anyway. Though. 22. Yes, let's go yes. already. Come on. Alrighty. Let's go. Okay. So they have four ships. And do we have any wormholes near us? No. <sighs> this is going to be a pain then. Alright. Well. I think I'm not going to bother with torpedoes. I'm just going to run up to them and fire lasers. <sighs> Get everyone as close as possible, so we should be able to do it the next turn without any finagling of torpedoes. And all that infinite joy of wasted time. Which I do appreciate anyone who's willing to sit and watch this, if anyone ever exists and does that. Thank you. Uh, yeah, I'm not trying to be lame, I just excel at it more than anything in the universe. So, let's see here, though. Anywhere we can do, this is 36 damage. Wow, that is bad. Both of them only 36, or just... Uh, yes, one or the other. Oh, they're sitting on the same tile, so that counts like that. Okay. Zero... Oh, that's even better. Good. So, maybe two less enemies? Enemy cannons disabled. Right. Two useless enemies. Oh, that's even better. Come on. So, we only ought to get... Unless they have reinforcements somewhere. Did their fleet just panic and leave? Or are they all disabled from the other battles? Uh, alrighty. Uh, zero, zero. Alright, well. Yeah, in turn. Okay, that guy can stay there. It doesn't matter. We only need two ships to fight him anyway. Ah, they're going all the way over there. How lovely. Uh, let's see. Anyone? Twelve or zero. Wow. Well, yeah, a little mess. Better than none, I guess. Come on. Okay. Well. Okay, well, we can get over here, see where that leads us. Entering the gate. Yep, that ought to do. Where's the next one we gotta do over there, but I mean like will the next wormhole I go through be a matter or an antimatter of doom Will that be good enough? Extra crispy. Are we done? Or are they cloaked? Okay, we're done. Sculptoris twenty two has joined our federation. Yay. Where did your fleet go? Is it disappearing completely or... Please don't hide somewhere. Is there another world you have somewhere or are you just leaving the map completely? Please be gone. 
Okay, oh, they're not even there anymore. Huh. They're parked out on the edge. I guess they're hanging out with the Reapers. Okay, well, I guess on shore leave we get to see whether or not we get attacked by these guys. Can we? Nope, we can't even move like that. Oh, can we build a wonder anywhere? Oh, whatever. Let's go. Let's see if the green guys start attacking me. They have... Oh, okay. Well, they can't because we still have the peace treaty. So that'll make it easier. But anyway, take care everyone and try not to go crazy.